G'day, this is Scott. Just want to do a very quick video on Sketchbook app for the iPad Pro. I'm just in the gallery at the moment. I'll load a painting I started and completed in Sketchbook. And it was 8,000 by 8,000 pixels and still allowed me enough layers. Uh, right up the top toolbar on the far right, it's a little square icon. If you touch that, you remove everything. So it gives me heaps of room to work. And down the mod bottom middle, sorry, if you touch that, it brings up a little pop-up menu. So on the right, you've got Flip Canvas, which is really helpful. Uh, the next one up from that brings up the Sketchbook Puck, which can bring up your color wheel and palettes, and also your brushes. And if you slide inside there, it changes the size and up and down will be the flow. And depending on the brush, if it's a different brush, it might be flow or opacity. So if I chose a so pencil, yeah, opacity and size. And then the next one, color picker, and just move that around. But you don't need to use that, you can just hold your finger on the canvas, like in Procreate. Next one is drawing in transparency mode. So you can use that instead of erasing. And the next one down is last brush, which I use a lot because sometimes I'm using um, two different brushes. So a soft and hard brush, so I can go back and forward. So if I'm using that brush from there and up here I'm using this brush, I can then revert back. So I'm using two different brushes. Then on the left, you've got this slider, you can bring up your whole brush menu, or your color palette and color wheel, or your layer, just by holding it and sliding it. Then when you release, you're back to your full screen. And the big top one is a quick shortcut to your size of your brush and the bottom one will be once again your flow or opacity all right i hope that's some help if you haven't seen those options before thanks a lot